For the past two weeks, I've been on a crazy grind, grinding almost 500,000 gems over multiple accounts, all leading up to this pivotal moment. Although I'm already at level 100 with a pretty decent team, there's still one thing that I have not yet got, that being the secret unit. For those of you who might not know, secret units are not just rare in anime defenders, but they're also the top of the line units with stats better than everything else in the game. Today, one of those units stands above the rest, that being the Rift Sorcerer, and I'm determined to get it. In today's video, we're not gonna stop open until we get the secret unit and if our 500,000 gems aren't enough to get this I'll have to stop the video and grind even more gems until we get this thing the stakes couldn't be higher but I believe we're ready to finally take this on so let's just dive right into this opening now really quickly I'm sure a lot of you guys want to see what my team looks like so far now I pretty much have a fully evolved team of uh, mythics right now the current lineup that I'm using is the flame dragon king as well as the Prime Carp, Skull Paladin, Donut Master for slowing, Monster Sorcerer is one that I'm actually building up right now, so I'm not sure if this is going to be a permanent part of the lineup yet. And then of course my money unit, we have a shiny bloomer here with Midas Touch. Now, if I'm being honest, I haven't done a ton of trait rerolls or rank rerolls on any of these characters because I've been saving all of that stuff up to use on the secret unit that I get first. Now, if we check my stats here, we could see that I have over 4,000 units summoned already in the game and I currently have zero secret units. I definitely think we are due to finally get our first secret. And if we do get the secret rift sorcerer in this video, I'm going to continue opening with the rest of my gems on the regular banner to try to get one of the other secrets. Now it's taken me forever to get this amount of gems for this opening. So if you guys could just go ahead and like the video and subscribe to the channel, it would help me out tremendously. And for my regular pet simulator 99 viewers, one of the things about this game that actually caught my attention was the trading plaza. So if we head over here, as you guys know, I like to do a lot of trade and I especially like games that have trading plazas like this and as you can see the trading plaza in anime defenders is extremely similar to the one that's in pet simulator 99 so not only have I been grinding but I've also been doing an absolute ton of flipping things to get gems in this game if I pull up my items, you could see that I have a ton of risky dice. And the reason why I have a bunch of these risky dice is because I like to actually flip these and sell them. While I do like the trading plaza in Anime Defenders, it still has a lot of work to do compared to the one in Pet Simulator 99. But still, it is very fun to flip and trade things. So for you Pet Simulator enjoyers, I think you would enjoy a lot of aspects about this game. But yeah, besides that, I'm not completely done playing Pet Simulator. 99 this is just another game that i can make content on when things are going kind of slow in pet simulator and i've also just been low-key addicted to playing this i honestly waste so much time playing this game every day and i honestly don't even mean to half the time but once you really get grinding playing this game it can be very addictive but let's just hop into summoning because i know this is going to take forever to open this amount of gems now like i said earlier if i do get the secret sorcerer from this limited banner then i'm also going to start opening the standard banner and try to get another secret from there so let's just go right ahead and buy a three times super lucky potion from the shop and begin opening these all right so we got our super lucky that means we have to start opening because the timer is going down quite rapidly honestly i don't know what i would say if we were able to just get the secret like in the first few spins after i went ahead and collected almost 500,000 gems honestly I might be kind of angry if I just get it in the first few thousand so hopefully it takes us at least a little bit to get this oh, we did just get our first legendary one thing I am hoping to get from this opening is a bunch of shiny mythics as well as shiny legendaries because I'm actually trying to build up even more accounts than the ones I currently have right now I currently have like about four accounts that are decently built up but if we could get some extra shiny mythicals or even just shiny legendaries to trade to those accounts 
that would be very helpful as well. As you can see, we're almost at our mythical pity, so we're gonna get a mythical right away almost. And I've also yet to even get a shiny mythical in the game, so I think my luck has been pretty bad. As you guys saw earlier, I've opened around 4,000 units so far without a secret or a shiny mythical. All right, so we just got our first mythical. Let's see what we got. All right, so it looks like the muscular sorcerer is in the banner right now. So this is just a regular one, but we'll definitely take that. It's better than nothing but like i was saying i've actually seen people in the anime defenders discord who have under 2,000 units opened and they've gotten a secret for themselves so i'm honestly not sure if we are just unlucky or if they are just super lucky themselves all right so we got our second mythical right there that is definitely very good hopefully it's a shiny okay not a shiny <laughs> A little, little bit of decent stats compared to the other one, but still nothing that good. We already have a muscular sorcerer in our lineup that I'm pretty sure is almost level 70 already. But if we do get a shiny one, I would definitely go ahead and level that up as well. But if you do enjoy anime defenders and you like these types of videos, let me know down in the comment section what types of videos you want for this game, because I already have a whole list of ideas that I can make. I also have a pretty solid group of friends that I'm playing the game with and we're going to be trying to push the leaderboards and push all the levels within the game so we're definitely taking this seriously and we just got our third mythical right there i almost didn't see that so once again just a regular muscular sorcerer nothing too special let's keep going because i don't want to waste my lucky potion at all i'm honestly not even sure how long it's going to take to open up 400 000 gems worth of these units so i have to make sure that i have enough lucky potions to be able to open Open this many and for those of you who are new to anime defenders and wondering how i know what type of unit we're getting when we're opening these when you actually open these packs and the star comes out you can tell what level of unit you're gonna get at the end depending on what color the star is that pops up so for example let's open here and we could see that this one is yellow now that means we're gonna get a legendary unit so if we keep opening we'll see that our last unit here is a legendary so whatever our best unit that we get from opening these is going to be the last one and that's going to determine the color of the star so for example if we get a mythical the star is going to be some like pink color and if we get the secret it's going to be a black star now obviously we got a yellow star here for the legendary and then the epic is purple and then the regular oh see see like right there that's a mythical we just got another mythical here. Hopefully it's a shiny. I think that's four mythicals. We're actually getting very lucky with the mythicals. I think we've only hit the mythical luck thing once. All right, okay. So we got our fifth mythical, I'm pretty sure. Let's stop. Let's see if this is a shiny. Got five mythicals in and we have not got a shiny yet. And by the way, we also have this game pass up here. As you can see, we have shiny hunter. So we actually have something very similar in Pet Simulator 99. Honestly, it doesn't seem like it works very well because I have not gotten one single shiny mythical yet in the game from over 4,000 of these units summoned. All right, so almost back to back, we got our sixth mythical here. Oh wait, what the? I accidentally let my auto clicker go through those, but I'm pretty sure we just got two actually. But unfortunately, none of them were actually shiny. Now, if you don't know what shinies actually do in this game, besides actually looking different for the units if you have a shiny version of a unit you can actually wear the clothes or the outfit that it has so for example i have a shiny bloomer here so i can click right here on the character and that'll actually make me wear <laughs> wear her outfit so you know while I do like this outfit, this looks quite snazzy on me. The coolest outfit of the ones that I have gotten so far is actually this electric cyborg. So I'm going to put back the outfit that I had on before. So this is the outfit from the shiny electric cyborg. And honestly, it looks pretty sick. So if I do get a shiny mythical, I can wear the outfit of that mythical. But besides that, a unit that is shiny actually does do 5% extra damage. So there is that benefit as well. Now I'm going to try to quit yapping because we have so many gems to go through for this opening. And I don't want to make this video just ridiculously long for you guys. All right, so we're back in the regular lobby. Let's continue opening over here. All right, so we actually got to sell some of our units because our inventory is currently full. Now there is a auto sell feature, but I do have it on to where it doesn't auto sell the shinies. Now, 
actually selling the units from your inventory really doesn't do much but gives you gold and the gold you can actually use to join raids in this game so gold is kind of useful and there's also some use as well with the guild let's not waste any more time let's keep going with these all right it's been quite a while since we've gotten a mythic as you can see our mythic counter has gone up to 270 units open without a mythic At the end of the day we're here for that secret rift sorcerer and if we get that that is really all that matters all right we got our seventh mythic now i think honestly i lost count here but oh yes finally a shiny mythic this is the first shiny mythic that we've gotten in the game and oh my god it's got nasty rerolls on it look at that that thing is disgusting honestly i wish it was the monster sorcerer too another thing i forgot to mention is that these banners change every hour so there's actually two different types of mythics you can get the other one that you can get is actually this monster sorcerer which i've already gotten evolved already so i technically don't really need another but if I did get a shiny one, I probably would upgrade it. But honestly, I'm still very hyped about that. Definitely glad we finally got a shiny mythic that we've opened in the game. Let's keep going. We just got another one. This is our eighth mythic. So we're actually getting pretty lucky here. And of course, I forgot to turn off the auto clicker again. So I don't even know if that one was shiny or not, but we'll check really quickly. All right, so we have been counting, right? We have one shiny one and then eight regular muscular sorcerers. So let's keep going. We're not even a hundred thousand. Oh my God, we got another one. What is that number 10? That's absolutely insane. All right, so not a shiny, but number 10 mythic. We are going insane with the mythic. Mythic number 11. Hopefully we can get another shiny. And okay, honestly, we're getting so many mythics that it's not even exciting to see a mythic pop up right now, which is pretty crazy. We just need, look, I, bro, these mythics are popping up like it's nothing. This one actually came with a brawler 2 trade on it too. So this is pretty good, but we definitely only want shinies right now or this secret rift sorcerer. Honestly, the earlier we can get this Rift Sorcerer, the better, so that we can begin opening the other banner and trying to get the other secret. There's absolutely no way we spend over 450,000 gems and don't get this. Let's just keep opening. I'm jamming the music, and this is honestly very satisfying, so I have no problem with this taking a while. All right, mythical number 14, I think, maybe 15. I think I skipped one here and there, but no shiny. Let's just keep going. I don't want to drag this video out too long but obviously this is going to be a super long recording so i'm going to have to cut a lot of yapping out but why else would you guys click on this video if you didn't want to hear me yapping about absolutely nothing mythical at number 16 i believe not another shiny but we keep moving forward another mythical come on just give us another shiny like why why are the shiny mythicals so hard to get i could i could just feel that one i just do we were getting it Let's keep going. All right, mythical number 17 or something. Who even knows at this point? Back to back mythicals is crazy. I forgot to even stop my auto clicker on the last one, but I don't think it was a shiny. Yeah, we still only have the one shiny muscular sorcerer, but look at all of these mythics that we have. What is that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 9, 14, 17, 18, and then 19. So we're 19 mythicals in. So somehow I even missed one earlier. Let's keep going. We're currently at 373,000 gems. Of course, I hoped that we would have the secret sorcerer by now, but getting the shiny mythical has been a big achievement for me. But let's keep going. I'm not losing faith yet. We have 21 minutes left on this lucky potion. So hopefully our luck is only picking up right now. Okay, wait, we actually got another shiny and the stats are so bad. Why are the ranks so bad on these shiny mythics? Definitely will take this though. Our second shiny mythic that we've gotten ever. Definitely going to be very useful for us later on. I'm getting so many mythics that I can't even stop the video and show you all of them. I'm getting like one of these like every five bunches of spins. So we are getting a ton of these mythics. We currently have five minutes left on this banner. So let's keep going. But I already know this video is going to be way too long. See, like, look, even while saying this, I got a whole nother one. 
Of course it's not shiny, but still, like, we are getting these, like, back to back to back. I'm even getting people in the lobby asking me for mythics at this point because they see in chat that I'm opening so many of them up. All right, so between these openings, I can see that my timer is almost done for my lucky potion. So we're gonna have to take a break really quickly here and get another lucky potion and then continue opening. But we still are getting a few mythics but nothing too crazy like of course not another shiny one and the banner did reset but it looks like none of the units in the banner actually reset so that's quite unfortunate i was really hoping we could get some of those monster sorcerers as well all right so our timer is up for our first lucky potion so let's actually take a little look at our statistics so we can see how many units we've opened in total. So if you look here, as you can see, we have 7,800 units summoned with absolutely zero secrets. While I know a lot of you would look at that negatively and say, oh, you're just unlucky, you suck, whatever, whatever. When I see this number, what I think this means is that the secret is absolutely cranking. I feel like we are due for some back-to-back -back secrets to make our luck turn around right now. 7,800 units summoned with zero secret units summoned is pretty crazy. I'm not sure if anybody has had worse luck than that. If you guys want to send me your stats for what you've opened so far in Anime Defenders, you can join my Discord, link down in the description below, and then post it in the win slash loss channel. I'll definitely be going ahead and checking that out because this is absolutely insane bad luck. But again, I don't want to make this video too long for you guys, so I'm going to buy another one of these super lucky potions and then re-log into the game to make sure the effect is in place. And then we're going to continue opening. So I'll see you again really soon, right? Another mythic right off the bat, hopefully secret. Okay, we wait, we actually got two. That's the first time I've ever seen two mythicals in one pack of 10. So that's pretty crazy. Oh, no way. I barely even noticed it. We actually got it. No. Oh my God. Bro, I saw that out of the corner of my eye. I was grabbing my drink. No way. We finally got it. Oh my God. That actually took much longer than I thought. You know, I was capping all positivity and stuff, but I was not being positive. I, I had no positivity going through my head. It's currently an hour and 30 minutes into the opening with double luck on both hours. It took that long, but we finally got it. Now I could complain that it's not shiny, which, you know, it's not shiny so I, that's a fair complaint but thank god we finally got this thing as much as i want to celebrate right now we still have 46 minutes on this super lucky potion and 280,000 gems so honestly let's switch over to the standard banner and start opening this one once we're done opening this banner i'll actually go ahead and we'll begin re-rolling the traits as well as the rank to try to upgrade that to be a even better secret that's actually crazy. Actually, first of all, we should check how many units in total it took us to get that. If we check the statistics here, it took us 8,500 units being summoned in order for us to get that. That is absolutely insane. I was starting to get tired. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna lie, the morals were down there, but we finally got the secret Rift Sorcerer. What a crazy opening this would be if we could get another secret from this one. Now, honestly, I'm not sure which secrets you can actually get from the standard banner, but if we look here, you can see that it's actually a secret percentage that it takes to actually get the secret, but I'm pretty sure there's at least like three or maybe even four secrets that are in this banner compared to only one that's actually here in the limited. So let's continue opening and hopefully we can get this other one. Now I have heard that this secret is a lot harder to get than the limited banner, but I'm not sure if that's real. And we did get our first mythical carp. Honestly, a shiny carp would be pretty sick as well. I'd honestly be down to upgrade a shiny carp as well instead of my regular carp. Honestly, I don't care that much about the shinies. It's more about principle that we just never get the shiny mythics, but I need at least one shiny carp. Come on. Oh, no way, no way, no way, we actually got it. Bro, I, wh what was that? Oh my God. Bro, I don't even know what we can get from this. I, bro, I, all right. For context, it's an hour and 55 minutes into this recording. So I'm pretty out of it mentally, but oh my gosh, what did we just get? Boys, there's no way we finally, we got a second secret in this opening. That's insane. A game or two, this is a good one, I think, right? Let me check one of the tier lists. Well, the tier list says it's not one of the best, but I'll take it. We went from having zero secrets to two. 
in this video that is insane and we still have 18 minutes left on our super lucky potion with 180,000 gems. Honestly, let me clear out my units and honestly, let's just keep opening. I'm 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 going to keep opening until this 18 minutes is up and then whatever gems we have left, I'll spend on trade rewards and stuff so that we can upgrade those secrets. That is absolutely insane, you guys. And we get a mythic right after. <laughs> Hopefully it is a shiny carp. Oh, carp with the bull's eye trait is not bad at all. I ain't gonna lie to you guys. I was getting, I was getting a little sleepy watching this thing keep going. But the opening is not over. Can we get three secrets in one opening video? That would be crazy. Oh my god! No way! We got a third. We got a third with three minutes left on the timer. Oh my god! There's no way. I swear. Guys, I swear to God, let me pause the music. Bro, if this is a shiny or something, this that would be insane. All right, so we have the gamer and we have the rift sorcerer and we just got a third secret in this opening. I can't believe it. I swear to you guys, you'll see in a second. We literally have two minutes on our luck timer. Oh my God. We got the gamer again. We either got really unlucky by getting two of the same secret or maybe you can only get one type of secret for each of the banners that are out. As you guys can see, we have a minute and 35 seconds on our lucky potion. There's no way we got that. That is actually a huge tub. Not only do we have a secret, we have three secrets. Now, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with that third one since it is a duplicate of the second one we got. But maybe I can just sell it and use those gems to upgrade some of the secrets that I do have. Or maybe we can use that to open even more secrets in the future. That is really cool. Let's just use the rest of this lucky potion because I'm not putting any Robux to waste at all. We're getting our money's worth from these lucky potions. All right, you guys. So two hours and 20 minutes into the recording, we're finally done opening. We spent about, what is that? Like, like 350,000 gems and we got three secrets in total. That is absolutely huge. Let's take a look at our statistics now. So we opened 12,000 units and summoned three secret units. So let's actually take a look. Let's unequip the ones we currently have. So we have two types of secrets now. We have the gamer as well as we have the rift sorcerer. So that is really cool. Now I was gonna do a bunch of rank rerolls as well as trait rerolls, but I don't want this video to be too long for you guys. So really quickly, I'm just gonna head over here to the trading plaza and see what the current wrap for each each of these is so the rap for the gamer is actually 259,000. so honestly those two gamer secrets that we got from this opening paid for the whole thing and then obviously the other secret is not going to be on this list because it is limited right now and it still is not tradable either way that is a huge dub we definitely clutched up with that opening remember to comment down below what types of videos you would like to see for this game and if you found the video enjoyable giving it a like and subscribing to our channel helps me out tremendously to know what kind of content you guys like personally i'm really enjoying this game and it does seem like there's a couple other tower defense games coming out soon that we can try as well so i definitely think it's a good thing to have options when it comes to making content like this but anyways let me know what you guys think down below this video was a huge w thank you guys so much for watching i'll catch you in the next one peace out